Right, David Towney McDonough, this is a video back to you. You got up last night and you're at a one-hour crack again that you are in the last two years. We went looking for you before, David. We couldn't get you. We went down this evening, David. We were a long time across from your house. We were up and down through Kilkenny City. You see it yourself there now, David, the video that this is going out with. That if we delay of our hands on you, your brother John Towney, Richard Towney, and John Towney's son, you're getting a voice in the story, lesson, you'll not get away with it. That's the finish of it now. If it takes us a week, takes us a month, takes us six months. We're going to come a crashy. It's going to take time. When we do, boys, ye are completely dead. Now, David, I'm not meant for this. But in the last two to three years, you never left my mother or my wife or my sister and us. All ten honest women are your mouth giving them scandal. Whatever type of an old fella does that. But David, I'm going to stoop to your level now, right? Is this. You were talking about my um, nearly six-year-old mother, an aged woman, not a well woman at times. Well, David, your old dirty, smelly mother that must be 70 or 75 years of age, that, the, that was the biggest prostitute that was ever walked in two shoes. You, old Aunt Towney I'm talking about now, right? And I promise you, David, and I don't want to be calling the woman names, but uh, you're driving me to it. When I see your mother, do you know what I do to her? I will drive my foot nine mile up in her cunt. Do you know her two big pissy flaps with pissy skirt? When I get her, David, well, along with you, I will do her bad harm. Now, did you hear that? Now, I didn't want to do it and say them things, David, but you drive me to it. Now, it's one thing for another, right? We went at that house today. You see it in the video. It's plain to be seen. Whoever has seen it now, they know we were there. David, that house is not worth touching. That, that's an old house that must be 150 years of age. Two old panes of glass at the front of the house. You've no cars. You've no stuff to break. If you'd stuff inside the house or if you were inside the house, into the house we were going. Even though that you're stuck into the barrack. Your back door, David, jump the wall and you're into the back of the barrack. We were going into your house if we knew you were inside there. But we watched it long enough. You're not there. You're not there. But I promise you, David, your time is running out. And when we come across that, bye bye to you. David, you know by uh, who this is, don't you? Listen, David Tony, until I tell you. You can get up now and you can make videos away. You keep on doing it. But your time is up. And I mean it. Your time is up. You're giving my mother scandal. You're giving my wife, my sister-in-law's, all saying this and honest uh, women scandal. Sure, hey, it'd take a junkie like you, wouldn't it? A smackhead, a heroin addict that's inside in sumo room um, injecting and smoking fucking um, heroin. I can tell you this, as what was just said. You, David, your brother John, your brother Richard, and John's son, your time is coming, coming very, very shortly. We are coming back to you. When we get you, I'm telling you now that there's one of you going into a brown box. You understand me that, do you? You're getting got, you dirty, junky, smackhead bastard. You keep it going. Let's see now what's going to happen. No, David. And I promise you, David, we're going to get you. If not, we'll get your brother or we'll get, we'll get your nephew. Or we'll get someone very, very close to you altogether, if you know what I mean. Very, and listen, I mean very, very, very close to you altogether. Listen, there's only two people saving them so far. But we won't keep paying heed to them two people. Them two people is begging and craving hoes not to have nothing to, to do with them. But I promise you it's not going to keep happening. If we can't leave our hands on you, David, we're going, we're trying. We're after driving 300 miles of a round trip. It's 150 miles one way. Right? It'll take time. David, we could be lucky the next time we'll go, we'll get you. Or we might have to go another ten times before we get you. And if we don't lay our hands on you, David, whichever the boys love, we do lay our hands on, they're getting every bit as much as you. You'll be got. Or You'll be we, got shortly. Or if not, we might get two old fellas that's very close to home after you. You'll be got, my friend. No. See you for now. Bye-bye. No. Over now, Tony. Good luck to you.